Today I'm sharing an easy way to make a pretty Snow on the Evergreens polymer clay veneer. The first layer is a sheet of Primo Sculpey Translucent and this was conditioned and rolled to a number four on my clay machine. The next layer is a sheet of Sculpey 3 Leaf Green rolled to a setting number three on the pasta machine. Just place that on top and I'm going to cut around and get rid of my excess translucent. I rolled over it with my roller just to make sure that those two layers were adhered and make sure I didn't have any bubbles. To make the evergreen pattern I'm using a couple of different plastic greeneries that I got off some Christmas decorations and just keeping in mind that evergreen branches tend to fall downward, I began to press these different pieces of greenery into that green clay. I sort of made a row and then turned and went the other way. I wanted it to look like almost like a forest of pine trees. After you've got the first layer of pattern on, if you want, you can take another type of evergreen, that's what I did here, and just sort of impress here and there to add a little bit different detail. So now we've got our evergreen, it's time to add the snow on the branches. And to do that, I'm using some white pan pastels. I loaded up my sponge, this came with the pan pastels, with some of the white and very carefully drag it over the surface of our evergreen texture. You want it darker in some places than it is in others because snow is not always falling on the evergreen branches in exactly the same amount sticking. Now you could stop here, you've got the effect of snow on evergreen branches, but I wanted to take it to another level. To add some dimension to the veneer, I wanted to add some dimensional snow and ice. To do that, I'm using some Sculpey liquid clay, this is the clear, and I'm just using a little silicone tipped tool. You could use a little paintbrush, and I'm just applying small amounts of it here and there over those evergreen branches. Then I'm going to apply Judikins Rocks. This is German glass glitter. It's real chunky and I absolutely love it. This is ice clear. You want to place those over the areas where you added that liquid clay. I'm just using a tiny tray to catch any excess and then I'll return it to the little jar. And there you can see that our snowy evergreens also have a layer of crystally icy sparkle. I decided to use my snow on the evergreens veneer to make some seasonal pendants. And I paired the veneer with some Primo Sculpey Accents Pearl Clay. And I did the mica shift technique, I stamped it with a couple of different stamps. I used Judykin's Snowflake stamp and a script text stamp and did the mica shift technique. And then I added a bit more of the rocks along the edge where the evergreen veneer meets the pearl clay. <laughs> 